Hey guys, what's going on? Um, just uh, doing an update here on my drunken gummy bears or the rummy bears, some people call them. Uh, this is the package we used. Just your regular fruit flavored uh, gummy bears. But we take a look at our uh, soaking container here. And as you can see already, the liquid has come down quite a bit. Um, this is the current line after one day of soaking. Uh, when I started, the, it was actually about, I don't know, that's about an inch or two above the uh, top of the gummies. And uh, as you can tell, they've certainly uh, gotten a lot more plump and, um, you know, sucked up a lot of that vodka. So they're looking good. Just have a little bit, uh, maybe a day or two to go. And um, you just want to make sure you stir them maybe, maybe every eight hours or so to... Uh, keep them from sticking together. Um, I'll try and grab one of the original, which is here. Give you an idea of how much they've already grown. It's a little hard to tell, but see if I can get it set up here. And I will reach into our vodka mixture. Oh wow, they are slippery little guys, but they've definitely plumped up already. Check this out, this is pretty sweet. I'm surprised. Okay, can you see that? On the left hand side there, we've got your regular straight out of the bag gummy bear. On the right hand side, that's a 24 hour soak in our vodka. So yeah, these guys are definitely plumping up. Um, I would say after give it say four days you'll expect them to be probably twice this size here so when uh, your friends all come over to have the party it'll be a nice uh, alcoholic candy and just be careful you know not to get uh, too crazy because it's easy to uh, just grab a handful and you know that's easily a couple shots of vodka so I think what I'm gonna do here before I put them back for the night is uh, Top it back off here with that last gummy. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit more vodka because I wanna make sure they're all covered at all times so that they continue to uh, soak up this vodka. So I'll go ahead and grab my bottle. We have the Pinnacle Tropical Punch. And like I said, when I started out, this was a brand new 1.75 liter bottle. This is about halfway gone from the first uh, dipping. So I'll go ahead and add a little more. Okay. Adding some for our little gummy guys. And you just wanna cover the top of them. And that looks to be plenty. So here we go. This is after 24 hours soaked. I went ahead and stirred them all around. Went ahead and re-topped them just to the top of the gummy bear limit uh, with a new little bit more vodka. And uh, we'll put it back in the fridge for another 24 hours, uh, stirring occasionally. And uh, we'll see where we're at tomorrow. Dun dun dun. Okay, here we are after uh, two full days of soaking. As you can tell, the gummy bears have swollen quite incredibly. I would say they are now easily about, I don't know, three times the original size. Um, I actually had to move them to a bigger container, which is different here as you can see, because they started to uh, swell up that one tube container I was using before and they're about to pop out of the top so this gave us a lot more room for them to grow um, I also added in if you can see the liquid here see that orange tint to it um, when I topped off the vodka this morning I also added in about a half of a cup of pulp free 100% um, orange juice 
I figured that would be a good way to get these a little bit of sweetness, maybe cut that um, alcohol taste. Okay guys, here we go. I've taken the bears. Uh, they've been soaking for about four days now in the vodka mixture. They've plumped up a very large amount, so now they're probably four or five times their original size. Um, during the process, you can take a bear, take a bite, make sure it's to the texture you like. Um, if you let them go longer, they're going to get softer. Uh, the shorter time you do, the more firm they'll be. So whatever you decide is up to you. Um, because there was still liquid in the container that I was doing the bears in, I decided I'd wanted to strain the liquid off so that I can serve them and they're not going to be, you know, dipping your hands in a bowl of juice or whatever. So um, we went ahead and strained it with the colander and uh, got a pitcher to reserve the liquid as you can see. That's full of delicious vodka, gummy, fruit flavor. So out of the uh, 1.75 liter bottle that I used, um, I would say approximately 75% of that got used up. Um, and then I used about a cup and a half of orange juice uh, just on the final day. Stirred that in and that kind of cut the uh, harshness to it. So now we've got the gummies. I'm going to let them continue to you know, uh, drain off a bit. And then we've got our leftover vodka mixture. I'll probably add some more vodka, some more juice, and some ice. And you'll have this as a extra cocktail on the side. Once your gummies are somewhat uh, dry, you can put them in a nice serving bowl and have them for all your friends. So uh, enjoy responsibly. This is definitely for adults only, 21 or older. <laughs> and uh, have fun with your new uh, drunken gummy bears.